Let's take a look at some other business headlines that we are watching today. It looks like the activist fund targeting Exxon Mobil ended up with three board seats instead of two. Exxon said in preliminary updated vote count showed that shareholders backed Alexander Karsner. He's a former U.S. Assistant Secretary for Energy Efficiency and Renewable Energy. Now he's a private equity investor. The fund, engine number one, only owns 0.02% of Exxon stock, but it teamed up with much larger shareholders to push for changes at Exxon. Tesla's recalls are growing, specifically of cars shipping to China. The electric car maker is recalling more than 700 Model 3s produced in 2019 because of seat belt and tire issues. This follows a recall of nearly 6,000 vehicles earlier this week in the U.S. on the potential for brake caliper bolts to loosen. Also recalls in February that affected more than 150,000 Teslas in the U.S. and in China. New York's Metropolitan Transportation Authority, the MTA, just disclosed it was the subject of a Chinese government-linked cyber attack in April. Transit officials said rider safety was not at risk. Meanwhile, the ferry operator for Cape Cod, Martha's Vineyard, and Nantucket said it was the target of a ransomware attack that could cause service delays. All of this, of course, comes on the heels of the hack of meat producer JBS, from which that company is still recovering. 